Hello ladies and gents, this is going to be the second video in this variable series that I was working on and now we are going to look into the strings that we have in the variables. So let's begin. Alright, so in front of us we have three different screens in three different languages. I took all these words from Google Translator so please, please don't judge me if I am using any word incorrectly. Okay, so from previous tutorial we know that local variables are here. When I click here, I can see all the variables that I created in the previous video that are colors. And if you want to change the name of the um, collection, you can just, you know, press here and change the collection. But now I need to create a new collection. So I'm going to press on create collection. I'm going to name it um, words for now. And I'm going to create a variable. And this time I'm going to go with string. Whoa, I got a friend request. Interesting. Never mind. Okay, so right here I've got string. I'm gonna click this and name the first string, let's say magazine title. And for the value, um, for, for the title we have actually three different values in, in English, in German, and in Spanish. So I'm gonna, you know, create three different modes. And for English, German, and Spanish, I'm gonna put their corresponding values. And similarly, I'm going to create all the other strings as well for stories, photos, and the see all button. Okay, so now you can see we have four different strings and for all of these strings, we have words in three different languages, English, German, and Spanish. Now, why did we do that? Let's go ahead. I'm going to duplicate this screen. And in this screen, we already are using the colors that were used in the last tutorial. So if you missed that one, please go ahead and watch that one first. But now let's talk about these strings first. So right here, we have four different titles. I'm going to select magazines. I'm going to go here. No, I'm going to go here and I'm going to take magazine title. And similarly for stories, stories title for photos. Oops photos title and for show all I'm going to select all of the three and select the show all link. So now if we if we want to uh, convert this whole screen into German all I gotta do is select this screen go right here and with, for words I'll just select German and similarly for Spanish I'll go here and click Spanish and moreover since we are using the colors uh, from the variables we defined in the last video, I can also just go here and, and turn this screen into the dark mode. So yeah, that's all. It was that simple. We'll talk about the variables in the next video in more details. But for this video, that's it. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, like the video and share it with your friends because I know a lot of people are stuck with variables right now. And one more thing. The images that you are seeing in these horrible screen designs are all done by me. So if you are interested to go through the photographs that I've done, you might want to follow me on Instagram because that's all what I do there. So yeah, cheers.